Phagocytosis is a process by which, a cell engulfs and eliminates large particles. In our body, macrophages are capable of ingesting and digesting exogenous antigens, such as whole microorganisms, foreign antigens as well as injured or dead host cells. In the first step of phagocytosis, macrophages are attracted toward a substance under the influence of various chemical substances generated by the immune response. This process is called chemotaxis. The next step in phagocytosis is the adherence of the antigen to the macrophage cell membrane. Adherence induces membrane protrusions called pseudopodia, to extend around the attached material. Fusion of the pseudopodia encloses the material within a membrane-bounded structure called phagosome. The phagosome moves toward the cell interior, where it fuses with a lysosome to form a phagolysosome. Lysosomes release lysozyme and other hydrolytic enzymes that digest the ingested material. The digested contents of the phagolysosome are then eliminated in a process called exocytosis. Most of the products resulting from the digestion of ingested material are exocytosed, but some peptide products may interact with class II MHC molecules, forming complexes that move to the cell surface, where they are presented to T helper cells. If the antigen is bound to antibodies, phagocytosis occurs more readily than antigen alone. Thus, antibody functions as an opsonin, a molecule that binds to both antigen and macrophage and enhances phagocytosis. This process is called opsonization, 